these types of content look familiar to you? They should, since the majority of people show a huge interest in them. In fact, they are available at almost every major store you visit. But what is it about singers, actors, football players, basketball players, and other entertainment that makes us so hooked on their content? Why is it so addicting to know about celebrity lives? And more importantly, what about these types of content? Why are they consumed the least? What are stories, articles, and interviews just not highlighting that makes this content not so entertaining to read to the vast majority of people? And why does the majority in general prefer to praise people for using their body and not their mind? To answer that, we'll need to figure out who makes these rules in the first place and where did it start? That must be Tom. Oh, Tom, I'm hi, so Lucy. glad How we could talk to nice you. Hi, Lucy. Hi, Lucy. Hi, Lucy. Sorry we're late, but uh, Eve had... Did those video clips seem somewhat entertaining? If you answered yes, that isn't by chance. I want you to watch two clips and tell me which one grabbed your interest more. Are you ready? business or hustle? Raise your hands. A lot. For me, the internet is for you. For me, if I sat down with these two dudes, the black shirt and the white shirt right in this third row, and they both raised their hands, for me, it's not about, if I was sitting down with you for three hours, it's not about coming up with a business that's gonna do 10 million bucks. It's about understanding how much money you make now working a job. Which one did you find more entertaining? Which one do you give the most attention to? If you like most, clip one had more excitement and a wow factor, while clip two, you may have had to focus on the topic a bit more and give more of your attention. We can conclude that clip two would have the highest drop-off rate based on attention span. It may surprise you that the things you've used, and currently still use, influence how long your attention span can be. Attention is not simply being able to attend to what we find entertaining, but it's a little more like a muscle. And that is, if you've developed your attention skills, you should be able to use that for sports, for mathematics, for preparing a good meal, for having a conversation, and for sitting quietly and observing your own mind. And if all your attention is good for is that which you find very stimulating, that gives a sense of arousal and entertaining, that's a poor substitute. If our attention span is so important, why is it that each generation gets worse at this? From a young age, the amount of programming from different media affects our ability to focus and learn new skills as we get older. There's been studies on this done that show over the last 15 years, our attention span has gone down. In the study in the year 2000, the average attention span was 12 seconds. The average attention span in 2015 was 8.25 seconds. Your ability to focus on long-form content has been slowly decreasing as you get older. This is not by accident. It's also not by accident that the people you tend to let distract you are entertainers, not the doctors, physicians, and engineers of the world. What's up, y'all? Big Snoop D-O-double-G. I want to welcome y'all to my house. See this artwork right here? Beautiful. Now we're going to take a look at my cars before we hit the guest house. I have a nice car. I got a Lincoln Navigator right here. I want to show y'all the whole little front. You know, we got the jacuzzi. We come home sometime, we just be wanting to chill. And I ain't, we ain't want no furniture. We're going to just do something different. These bad boys. The engine is crazy. Many of y'all little Mustangs, y'all little Corvettes, y'all little Porsches. Y'all pull up against this, y'all going to lose. Time crisis. Who don't like time crisis? Come on. It's time crisis. 
You may not recognize everyone in the clip shown, but one thing is true, they all have money. This money is earned from you giving up your time to be distracted by them. The problem presented is clearly visible. The more you're distracted, the less time you have to focus on content that will enhance your future. If your attention span is not long enough to absorb information to better your future, you will not be able to learn from an inability to focus. This creates a wealth gap to distraction and keeps a vast majority of people earning less than the ones that make this content. The reality of this is you miss out on a major secret that the media doesn't tell you. Most fail to realize that the money these entertainers make is less than the people trying to help you better your financial future. These people have become wealthy and successful above the rest because they in fact chose not to be distracted. This wealth was created from the use of their mind, not created from how well they could do a physical talent that would eventually disappear through old age. One thing has been proven. Using your mind to earn money is the best way to achieve wealth. Rather than teach your friends and family to entertain the ones that control the money, so don't we teach them how to control the mind and not be the source of entertainment? The question is, will you be able to remember what you learned in this video today? To test your focus, the word attention has been shown multiple times in this video. How many times did you see it? Are you paying attention? Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you've enjoyed it, please be sure to hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell while you're at it so you get notified each and every Friday when I post more relevant content for you. Share this video with your friends and your family and make sure you remember that knowledge is power. Invest in your health and your wealth. And I'll see you guys next week for the next installment of this mini series. Let me know in the comments below what you think about it. I thank you guys and I appreciate all the support you've been giving me so far. And I'll see you guys next week.